Thank you, Bailey. It's not just the Pirates. It's been a rough start to the year over in Chapel Hill. Coming into today's game, the Tar Heels were 1-4 and four in the season, coming off back-to-back -back losses to Duke and Georgia Tech. Carolina was back at home this afternoon, but would not get any easier for Larry Fedora and company. That's because Brian Kelly and the 21st-ranked Notre Dame Irish were in town. Second quarter, already 7-0 Notre Dame. The handoff goes to Josh Adams, waits for his hole, hits it, and he's gone 73 yards to the house. Notre Dame goes up 14 to nothing in the heels. They didn't help themselves much in this one. A little bit later, Chaz Surratt looking downfield has Anthony Ratliff Williams wide open, but he drops a gimme touchdown right there. He would, however, get some redemption still in the second quarter. Surratt goes back to him this time. Ratliff Williams hauls it in much tougher catch that time. It was 16 7 at the half. It didn't get much better in the second half. The handoff this time goes to Dion McIntosh. He jukes and he's gone 35 yards for the touchdown. That put the Irish up 26 to 7 and they would cruise from that point on. Notre Dame hands North Carolina their third straight loss. The heels drop to drop 33 10 to Notre Dame. Larry Fedora still has some searching to do for answers. Comes down to me is the head coach putting them in a position to uh, be successful and I haven't found a way to make that happen yet. If I knew what it was, I, I would have I would have changed it. I, I, I can assure you, you know, every minute of the day that uh, that that we're working on it.